Hey guys, Grimnar here, playing a little Halo 3 on Ghost Town. And I wanted to talk to you guys about something that has been around in gaming since the first game of multiplayer was ever played. The Teabag. No matter what game you play, be it Call of Duty, Battlefield, or our beloved Halo, this rapid crouching over your dead body is the most infamous taunt in gaming history. And there's a dirty way of saying without verbal communication that I got your number. But a sad thing is happening across all of these games, and that is the improper use of the bag. Unfortunately, this is one of the many secrets that did not pass down from the greats of a bygone era. And thus, this new generation of gamers lacks this knowledge. However, I have dug into the past, studied the lost art form, and have unraveled its code of proper use. The teabag is used in place of words, as I said before. But what qualifies? What warrants such a display? One does not just give the bag to every opponent one finds. It must be cherished and only given or shown to those of equal or superior caliber. To better show what I mean by this, here are a couple of do and don't clips. See this nice three shot kill? It's nice, but not worthy. However, this perfectly timed rocket to Warthog Blast and this double kill against the OS player and another player are worthy of the teabag. So how do you know what is and what is not worthy of the teabag? Almost any situation that by all rights you should have died from is teabag worthy. And when it's two or three on one and you win, it's worthy. When you snipe the tank driver in CE or straight up destroy it in Halo 2 and 3, it's worthy. When it's 6v6 or 8v8 and you find one of your friends on the other team in matchmaking, it's worthy. So to all you new players out there, remember not just the humility, but the honor of the bag. And use these words of wisdom. When you achieve that kill, is it worthy of the time-honored classic? Does this kill deserve what you're about to give them? If you could show this to all your friends and they respond with a resounding yes, then this is the time to show them what's up that you are your gamer tech, and you took them to school on that encounter. That is what the teabag is for. Teabag is an art form, so above all, respect the bag. I'm Grimner, signing off. You can move a mountain, you can break rocks, you can be a master, don't wait for luck. Dedicate yourself and you go find yourself. Standing in the Hall of Fame, yeah. And the world